Hello, hello, and welcome once again. J76NY here returning to Operation Watchtower, our American playthrough on War on the Sea. Uh, we have been dealing with repeated submarine attacks, so it's nice to finally see some surface ships to take on. Uh, we've got one more flight of Dauntlesses inbound for the day, and the Tar Heel Strike Group is facing down the destroyers that are in the southern Solomon Sea. Uh, over towards the Guadalcanal area, we have a supply convoy moving up with a large amount of troops and also a supply convoy that started ferrying uh, fuel up so we can build that airfield up. Uh, I'm hoping that the troops that are on the first supply convoy do it, push us over the edge, and capture Guadalcanal. That'll be a definite step in the right direction. So sit back, relax, and enjoy episode number 56 of our War on the Sea playthrough. Supply two. Right, how far out are you? You are 16 hours out. Our Kingfisher is uh, encountered a zero way out here. We'll just leave. Quickly leave. Oh, there's the destroyers. Alright, so we know they're still in the area. I think these guys are probably... Well, they still got plenty of fuel. Let's keep them... There we go. Oh, slow down. Okay, Avengers... Move in. Tar Heel Strike Group. And then to intercept. Right. Tactical. Let's form them up into two groups of three. right now. And there they happen to be right in front of us, so... Have you nav out? For now, until you can get your altitude down. Pick your targets, boys. Hey. 
they are maneuvering, so we gotta get a better position than this. firing on us and attack oh they do and we got some decent hits right, try and save these guys one. Alright, Red Squadron. Attack. on her as well. And I'll send you off in this direction here. Let's see if we get a, any losses on this group. Looks like they got away. Check the damage. Heavy and heavy and moderate and heavy. Right, let's pick ourselves a Dauntless or a Avenger that's not smoking. Do some scouting. That would be you. Nice if at least one of them sank. Looks like she's got some fires that are uh, spreading. They're heading in opposite directions. Still got her speed up pretty good though. Yeah, I think if she was going to sink, she would have already. Yeah. Alright, let's get out. TB. It's going to be a little bit before Enterprise can launch. We're almost uh, done for the day with their operations anyway, so maybe up to uh, the Tar Heel Strike Group to take them out. Okay, Surface Action Group 8. Let's check here. 60. There's Destroyer group there. And a scout plane, so I'm assuming there's another sub we're going to have to deal with. Alright, let's pause for a second. Surface action group 8. I want you to head up and relieve surface action group 5 so they can make their way back and rearm. 
actually just these two destroyers, but we'll figure it out. All right, our hill strike group has an engagement. Let's take them out. This isn't a submarine caught us before we got to the destroyers. All right, let's have Hughes, Anderson head north. Pump your speed up. Pump your speed up. Indianapolis, who is damaged? Make your top speed. Alright, San Juan's moving to avoid. Chester can head with San Juan. Find these destroyers. Nice if I had a kingfisher in the area. Seeing them. things up a little bit. North Carolina's outpacing the uh, Indianapolis. They gotta be around here somewhere. Where could those destroyers be? Would like to finish off that group. But I don't see them. Don't see them anywhere. turn this way really thought they would have been to the north of Masians that's where they were actually we're gonna have these guys oh look at the San Juan down here spinning in circles do this for so long before I move out and try and re-engage elsewhere. So far I haven't seen anything. Let's take a look through the binoculars, see if they're dead ahead. Here. 
090. There we go. They are running. How far out are they? 24,000 yards. Moving at 29 knots. San Juan. These two slow pokes are gonna probably not even engage, but we can bring them into the combat areas. Well, they're probably gonna get away. Cowards. Let's identify her as we move. Sashio. Chester, how you doing for main gun ammo? Oh, <laughs> wow. How about secondaries? Do you have any of those? I think we're going to have to send uh, more than one group back to rearm. Yeah, she's running. We're not going to be able to catch her. As she turns. Alright, this is unfortunate, but it is what it is. I didn't realize, uh, some of my surface groups were so far uh, in the hole with their ammo. Have you come up? Have you start heading back? Actually, you could. Probably make better time back to, uh, here. Our Hill Strike Group has encountered the Destroyers yet again. This time we have a Kingfisher in the area. Help us spot them. Behind us. Hello. All right, Chester, how you doing for ammo? Nothing. Ninety rounds of high explosive or armor piercing. Okay, turn you around. San Juan. You're doing better with the ammo. Turn you around, Indianapolis. Have you met out here? Anderson, we're gonna turn you opposite direction. North Carolina. And Hughes.
All right, let's start targeting. Target number two. That would be the Asashio. San Juan. Target number one. I think we got two Asashios. Chester. Okay, open up with your secondaries as well. Anderson, pause this, make sure we don't have any collisions. Okay, Indianapolis, you can still target even if you are severely damaged. We got the first, second Asfacio. North Carolina, you can target with your secondaries. Anderson. Target her. Use. Target her. How do you stand for ammo? Not too bad. And secondaries. North Carolina. Just your secondaries. It's not what I wanted to do. We'll just turn her this direction here. Okay, we'll keep the Kingfisher up over target. Make sure she doesn't get shot down. See through the binoculars. Make sure everyone's firing. Do 
it looks pretty damaged. See, we actually got managed to get some hits on her. She looks like she's just laying smoke, so. San Juan, we're going to want to turn you so your broadside, your full uh, armament can come to bear. Got a very serious fire going there. And uh looks like she's taking some hits as well. turn use as well Esther All right, we're gonna have you hold your fire let the destroyers take care of uh, that first Asashio you can target number one here She might be getting out of range with her secondaries. Yep. How about North Carolina? What's her range? Sashio. Fire when ready. He's not looking very good. Let's see what the damage report is. Heavy and heavy on both. to just let loose with the uh, main guns there Who we have over here that's smoking got some minor damage on the uh, Anderson okay we're gonna 
have to start closing the distance a little bit here. move up in a position like this, but we're going to have Anderson slow down a bit, get those fires under control. Anderson's maneuvering how I don't want her to. Let's switch her fire hues to number two, number one, San Juan. you to switch your fire to number two. And Chester, you can continue firing your secondaries as we bring them into uh, into the arc. Alright, how's the fire? in this ship under control so we can bump her speed back up alright there we go good okay target target open fire Sixteen thousand yards. And we could probably let her take some shots with her main guns. I'm gonna save North Carolina's ammo for something a little bigger. Too long for this one. She's 
pretty damaged. There we go. That's what I like to see. Heavy damage, heavy flooding. There goes Asashio number one. We'll watch from this perspective for a minute. There's another good hit. There we go. There's some more. Let's see if we can do some camera work here. Lock map, select mode, target mode, freeze camera. There we go. Let this watcher go by. Oh, 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 we're losing her. getting hit <coughs> pretty good now zoom way out freeze the camera she's just a massive flames look at that still firing on us though Still a threat. Is off there in the distance burning. Early moving now. Shouldn't take too much longer. Down to 14 knots. Eleven knots. The death of a destroyer. smoke if she's still afloat I do not know and there she goes nose dive good job all right let's go through our damages and make sure we don't have anything that needs to be repaired before we leave battle a little bit on the hues we'll just bring everyone to a stop
Not a bad surface engagement. Alright, let's take a look at the hues. That won't take long. Speed through it. Alright. After this battle, I'm probably going to call the stream to a close. Um... I do have the full series up on YouTube, J76NY is the uh, name there as well. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, I think it's probably going to be like episode 55, 56. Um, so head on over there if you're on Twitch and uh, follow along over there. Hit that subscribe. If you're watching on YouTube right now, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate all the support. Gotten quite a few sub uh, sub new subscribers, so welcome to the uh, battle for the Solomon Islands, specifically Guadalcanal. Um, if you would like to follow along, hit the subscribe button. Seems kind of weird doing this YouTube stuff on Twitch, but whatever, I'll probably decide it over it anyway. And we are safe to leave. All damage is repaired. Uh... They are probably going to have to go back and rearm. We'll send them up to um, the closer, I think, Port Moresby. We got eight more command points, and they are on their way to Port Moresby to rearm. All right, Surface Action Group 7 is heading out. The Enterprise Metal Group is still in the area. Tautog is still hanging out here. Greenling... We've almost got Surface Action Group 8 in here to relieve Surface Action Group 5. Our supply convoy with a whole lot of troops on it is 15 hours out from Guadalcanal, so that'll probably be the next stream. All right, that's going to do it for today's episode, episode number 56. Uh, a little bit of overkill there on those two destroyers with the um, bombing run and the uh, Tar Heel Strike Group. Uh, but we had to uh, get rid of them, and Tar Heel Strike Group was very limited on ammo, and it didn't seem to matter, so we cleaned them up pretty good. Anyway, if you like the episode, hit that like button. We are moving closer and closer to victory, so if you're new here and want to follow along, uh, hit the subscribe. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I'm looking forward to continuing the series, and hope you are enjoying it as well. J76NY saying thank you very much for watching and have yourself a very good day.